YouTube. Um, I'm here doing another Twitch stream. Uh, as you can see here, I have my uh, intro animation screen, which is a puzzle from the game. Um, early part of the game. Here, chapter one. All right, puzzle editor. So, uh, we're starting off with a quiet today on the Twitch end, so I'm just going to dive into the idea I have in my backlog that I haven't made yet, uh, which is to try, most of the time, when I start this stream, I happen to have a pot of tea over on the table next to me, because I really like tea, and you can, at the Korean Mart around the corner from my house, I can get half a kilogram for five bucks. Like, literally five bucks plus tax, I think. Might not even be taxed. So I drink a ton of gunpowder green tea. I have a whole technique to get it at the right temperature so it doesn't taste get the burnt taste. Even though I like the burnt taste, so I don't care if I get it wrong, but I do try to get it right. So, tea. I'm going to try to make some kind of alchemical tea in the game. Uh, so... Like, earth and salt are the obvious starting points because we want to make... Actually, come to think of it, we could start with distilled water. That's probably the starting point. Like, just no, not even making the tea leaves, directly making a beverage. that That is tea-like beverage, but... Um... Something which a tea a tea like beverage, but uh, possibly more something. Okay, so for distilled alcohol, the way they did it was they had water like this. This is the distilled water um, shape. Yeah. They had some water, and then they attached something to it. So for for alcohol, it's fire. Um, but obviously, we're not making alcohol. We're making some kind of tea. So leaves. Leaves are the part of the plant that draws in... nutrients from the air and the sun so let's, let's start off with just this and think about whether we want to add anything else to that i mean the obvious thing to add to that is is one of these babies um I mean, that's plausible, honestly. Uh, yeah. Okay. So what I'm thinking right now, in as depicted on screen, is you have water with something attached to it, and that thing attached to it is the, the tea part. Let me look at, like, some of the other things that people drink in Opus Magnum. Like, the health tonic is water with a couple of these uh, vitae attached to it. The stamina potion is two waters with an iron in the middle. Um, so maybe it would make sense to go something like you have iron, earth, vitae. Or even just iron earth or iron salt. Um, let's see what else. I mean, there's there's like the mist of incapacitation, which is like a drug. Um, um, looks like we have a viewer. Hello. Um, I am trying to make some kind of tea in uh, Opus Magnum, and I'm just thinking through thoughts. Um, 
Like, they're... Like, I was going to start with uh, sort of the same way that distilled alcohol works, where you have the three-element thing of distilled water, and you attach something to it. So, as of right now, I've had... The ideas I've had have been something like this with an optional Vitae, or... Um, like this with an optional vitae because like iron is a component of the stamina potion which is one of the things that you make early on in the game uh, tin shows up in a lot of kind of aerosol kind of in, in, in like floating powder kind of contexts I mean that actually might make sense for tea is something which is like a sort of floating uh, whatever I mean you could just directly attach one of those tin compounds from the um, fragrant powders episode to the water compound and just be like, okay, this is my tea. Um, like, something like this. Um, in the fragrant powders puzzle, it was either both, so it was either uh, earth up here, earth down here, or both, and the Missing spot was salt if it wasn't there. Um, do, do, do. Okay. Yeah. So, so these are sort of the thoughts I have in my head so far is um, one of the metals uh, potentially um, or just earth and like other things, possibly a Vitae, possibly not. Um, I mean, it might make sense to just sort of copy the stamina potion kind of thing and have something where it's like, this is like the stamina potion, but it is, but different. Maybe, I don't know, something like this would make sense. Like, it's not floating fragrance in the way that um, you got with the... The... Wow, brain. Um, not like floating fragrance the way you got with the tin things, but just... I know. It's probably good enough. Um, yeah. I don't know. I think it makes some sense with, like, the game text. Possibly you. It would be water instead of earth over here, but I don't know. Um, or maybe one earth and one salt. I'm gonna keep it simple for for now. Might as well make a simple puzzle. Simple puzzles are fun. So for this, so if we were going with simply atoms, we would have water let's let's start with the metal because 
like. We would have metal, we would have water, we would have earth, and possibly salt. Like that would be, these are the components of it. Uh, I mean, I could, I'm not, uh, like there's so many ways you can be inefficient that it's almost like too vague a concept to be like, what's the most inefficient way to solve a puzzle, Earl? Um, I mean, I could try to do something daft with solving this puzzle. Um, It's all good. All good. Um, yeah, I think I'll just do it like this. Um, but yeah, I, I, I can go ahead and try to be daft here. Let's, let's, let's see what kind of ridiculousness, uh, comes to mind. Uh, so like the sensible, I'll solve it both ways. Uh, okay. Um, all right, so let me see if I can explain the game while I'm busy putting the puzzle together. Um, mm, that seems fun. Okay. All right, I... I uh, I have an idea. Um, okay, but... Uh, Sorry, uh, yeah, yeah, it's a, it's an alchemy puzzle game where, like, you, um, you, it's an alchemy puzzle game where you have these 15 different alchemical things, atoms, and you bond them together and combine them and make puzzles out of them uh, and, and, and turn them into products. So, like, if it was just these three, it would be water, distilled water specifically. Um, and yeah, the point of this stream is people go like, wouldn't it be cool if we had a puzzle for smelling salts? And um, and uh, I try to invent, it, it's, I mean, it's not better anymore than like is, uh, or is like, cheese better than bread it's just you're making different things and they work and they do different things or probably better example is cheese better than a car like these are different things which you evaluate for different reasons and different purposes you are making stuff uh like the tutorial you you made uh the, there was some laboratory burner fuel um there were, in first level, there was a waterproof sealant for, like, ships and stuff. Um, airship fuel. Precision machine oil. It's stuff. Only it's stuff interpreted through this, this strange alchemical lens instead of stuff interpreted through, like, what we're used to with, like, a periodic table of elements and so forth. Um, okay. So I think what this is going to... I think for this puzzle, I'm probably, my first solution is probably just going to be, let me make it two different ways. Um, hmm. Okay. Uh.
speed. Oh, sorry. Um, It's, yeah. Sorry, I don't know what I'm saying now. Um, yeah, it's a puzzle game. You use these little machines and this little programming uh, area to move these little atoms around to make, to put together. Like, this thing will bond things together. And you use all this stuff to put together a... Um, sorry. Uh, yeah, so to, uh, it's an alchemy game, and you use this stuff to put together puzzles. Um... I am taking advantage of the symmetry of this thing and putting together both halves in exactly the same way. Um, okay. So, let's slide this up here for a moment. Right. I'm just doing this because it amuses me. This is not the most efficient way to do it. Um... Oh, right. This has to actually wait a second so that... you need to return to your origin point. Okay. Um, anyway, the point of the stream is that... is that I'm getting people to offer suggestions of things to make and then making them using this this game engine. Okay, so I have... Sorry! Sorry, sorry. Oh. Sudden sneeze. Uh, okay, so I have this here. If I rotate it twice, I could just rotate it three times. All right.
Oh, wait a second, wait a second. One of the, one of my, uh, um, quirks as a player is that I try to have this emblem on the game map in an aesthetically pleasing place in the puzzle. So, yeah. Anyway, the idea here is, yeah, you can kind of see the, the, what the game is in what I just did is I am... Putting together a machine that solves a problem, and then that machine moves in a kind of cool looking way to solve the problem, and I make a gif of it and I can post it on the internet for other people to go, oh, that's kind of cool. Um, this stream is about... Um, this stream is about making up new puzzles. Um, like the idea is, uh, ideally people in the chat suggest things and I turn those into a thing. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and end the recording for this segment and start the recording for the next segment and we will figure out something to make. Where's my index card with my hotkeys written down on it? Ha! In segment, start segment.